Hey y'all, we about to start a new vlog, okay? So, first off, <laughs> yeah, this is my favorite wig right now, just thrown and go. And I was gonna wet it. And I'm like, it's kind of giving a look like this puffy. So I left it like this. Um, This vlog will be very, I'm not gonna say basic because it's very much packed full of things that I did. But, it's very much blah, okay? So, um, last vlog, I served y'all look after look after look after look. Numbers still did the same, so I might as well come to y'all in rare form. Because I used to have this thing thinking like pretty things attract. And so, people will watch the vlogs more if you're like dressed up and stuff. Uh-uh, that ain't it. So, we just gonna go with the punch, okay? Um, this was a very emotional vlog. It started out very emotional because it made a year of my son's passing. So, like, that's why I didn't do anything this week. Like, and, and to make matters worse, if you watched the last vlog, Suge was sick and she did have COVID. So, not only was it a year of my son's passing, we were, like, literally stuck in the house. Couldn't go out and get our mind off of it. But anyway... Guys, I'm in my robe. Excuse the extra. Y'all know how I feel. I'm in my robe today because I do want to discuss is my health. Um, I often do my vlogs as if everybody know me. And I never... Am I in focus, y'all? I never think about the fact of if like you stumbled across this video or someone sent you. Or it's your first time watching me would if you would understand what's going on so long story short two and a half years ago i went to jamaica um ate something got parasites in my stomach it ate up the sm my small intestines lining i got h pylori a whole bunch of other stuff from it and it has been a long journey healing now before they knew that's what it was i went on a strict diet and started to lose weight from the strict diet now that's where the subject becomes taboo because a lot of people are like, you were losing weight because you were sick, which might be true, but don't stun on me. I did change all of my eating habits too. So anyway, fast forward. Now I am still managing to keep the weight off with a healed stomach because I still have a pretty clean diet. Oh, I cut up, but not like I used to. You get what I'm saying? It's nothing wrong with over, with indulging from time to time, um, but it's about balance. Like it's a lot of stuff I just strictly don't eat anymore. Like if I do, I taste it. You guys see me go out all the time and you should see the doggy bag I bring home to my daughter. It's just, I wanna taste it, blah, blah, blah. So that's how I really maintain my weight loss. Um, I drink lots of water. I drink so much water. Oh my gosh, I drink so much water. And like I say, when I go out, I'm very cognitive of what I get. Instead of getting the burger and the fries, get a salad. Instead of getting the tacos, get a taco salad. Instead of getting soda, get water. Instead of getting um, chocolate, get fruit. Instead, You know, you can still... I'm going to do a whole video on it. Like, how about a, a, like a day in my life? where i do like two days and i just go to like where i eat and stuff first of all let's reverse that the number one thing is to eat at home but if you have to eat out if you have a busy life like me i will do a video on how i manage to eat out all the time and still um manage to keep my weight off actually i've lost five more pounds um which is weird because you guys know i had covid like two months ago and gained weight during covid and it put me in a panic oh i don't want to go back there honey i don't want to go back there um, but I've lost the weight that I, by the end of COVID, I lost the weight and, um, lost four more pounds. So my goal weight is 180 because I have very large breasts and a very large stomach. Okay. And the rest of my body is small. My legs small, my hips small, my butt. And so it kind of looks unproportioned when I get too small. So if I start getting over like 188, I panic because I'm like, I'm too close to the 200s again, and I was roughly like 265, 270 before I lost all that weight. I almost lost 100 pounds. So, all right, guys. So basically, what I did was replace a lot of carbs with fruits and greens. Um, when I eat out, I'm very careful what I eat, or I don't eat. Small. You really can eat whatever you want to eat, just don't over overly indulge. Like I used to go get a plate full of spaghetti. Um, and now I just get like three spoonfuls, taste it, and eat a salad. Does that make sense? 
So, my doctor was saying, um, y'all saw that in my last visit, that my stomach is healing. It still can flare from time to time because I have slight gastritis, but what I need to make sure I am doing is having a bowel movement every day. So that stuff is not toxic in my system. She recommended Miralax and a stool softener and all of that. And you guys know I have internal hemorrhoids too. So that's what all that is for. But I told her I'm not doing Miralax because you guys know I do Bellway. And honestly, I don't do Bellway every day because it's to the point if you have ever been in a condition, if you have ever been in a situation like me, sorry, it's, it's a long intro. Um, you will know that from taking medicine two, three years straight, it gets exhausting. And although Bellway is not medicine, it's like some days you just want to break from having to drink stuff, take stuff, take a shot, take a... And so I don't do it every day, honestly, but that's dangerous. And when this came out, honey, you talking about shouting for joy? Child, look at this. Look at this. Look this. What do I always tell y'all about Bell Way? I love it, I love it, I love it. But if you don't drink it right away, it gets so thick. And that con consistency throw people off sometimes and deters them from taking it. You know what I'm saying? Um, so there's many different flavors, and but it's just the consistency sometimes will make you not want to do it. So when they came out with these, fresh off the market, y'all. Fresh off the market. You know I was excited. So let me tell you a little bit about what Bellway is. This is this is my commercial for Bellway because they can tell you what it do, but I'm going to tell you what it do for me, okay? It helps regulate the heart because what you fail to realize, if you're not making a bowel movement every day, toxic stuff is in you, and it start messing with your heart rate, start having heart palpitations, racing heart you just start feeling icky icky so it helps with that it helps with a smooth move it helps with your skin and stuff because of all that toxic is coming out of your body your skin and stuff gets better it helps with bloating it just gives you an overall feeling a lightweight feeling it gives you more energy because it helps pushes you it's not a laxative it's just a fiber a super fiber that helps you go every day okay so this is the capsules, okay? So let me just read out the bottle. They're organic, um, prebiotic fiber, dietary supplement, helps regulate digestion. There are 160 capsules in here. And of course, they're gluten, vegan, free. They're the lab. They're not testing on rats or anything like that. And um, it's organic, okay? So I always look at the calories and stuff in here because a lot of you guys, a lot of stuff I recommend, you're like, Oh, all that sugar in there and all that. So, let me see. It's 10 calories per serving. Carbohydrates, 2 grams. It's nothing in the ingredients. Girl, I can read them. Organic rice hulls capsules. Like, now this is the thing. As an adult, you got to take 5 of these per day. 5 capsules. And I know a lot of y'all don't like taking pills. So, that's the only downfall. But I look, I really take these pills. Then drink the <laughs> liquid. So let me just show you what one look like. This is the size of one. They're not big horse pills or anything like that. But you do have to take five a day. You can take them up to two to three times per day. Now usually I will show y'all how to make it and all that. But y'all know how to take a pill. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> yeah. And I already took them today. It's roughly like three o'clock in the evening. So um yeah. This is this is bomb. Um, Bellway. On the website, they do take your insurance. I think it's called FHS or FHA or something like that. So check that out. I will leave my direct Bellway link below um, and a discount code. So shop the website so you can get a discount code on them, okay? I'm so happy about it. I, I really want to jump up for joy, but that's just doing too much, okay? So I will make sure I leave the link to Bellway. Thank you, Bellway, for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. And I'm just, uh, child, I'm happy because who got time to be shaking, stirring, look, 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 before it gets thick? Not me. Let's move on. So, honey, since I have y'all in here, let's just go over a few more things. This vlog is going to be full of a lot of unboxings and stuff. Here we have Lynn Smart. You guys know I love Lynn Smart. I show you two pair of glasses from them every week. So, that's the container. Your glasses will come in a storage case like this. 
each pair of glasses will come with information about the company and a black rag right there at the bottom to clean your glasses with each pair of your glasses will 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 um be wrapped in plastic like this of course i'm gonna leave the direct link to the glasses that i have on that i wear all the time i get so many freaking compliments on these glasses guys like i can't go anywhere like get these so i will leave this link below and the two pair i'm gonna show you below um these glasses started like five six seven dollars they have everything shades blu-ray glasses prescription glasses plug your prescription in on the website there's no point of getting the lenses taking them to your i mean getting the frames taking them to your doctor getting paying more to get your lenses put in them when well, you could just do that all on bellway i mean dang <laughs> lens smart you can just do that all on the lens smart website just make sure you have your updated prescription from your doctor okay so let's just go over the two pair i show you guys two pair almost every video i'm being this is not lazy girl this works smarter not harder what are you talking about i'm gonna say i'm being lazy so let me show you all this pair right here it's uh is that brown yeah it's like a brown and a clear pair and that's the thing oh these are real thick and sturdy that's that pair right there i don't think these are prescriptions but if they do put your prescription in them girl these will be too cute look at them oh my gosh oh my gosh i wish these were prescription let's just pray let's just pray nah they not they like sunglasses oh my gosh live smart why you gonna put my prescription in these okay Lynn smart link is below <laughs> thank you Lynn smart for sponsoring this portion of the video <laughs> one thing about platinum she gonna get them sponsors baby i'll be having to turn them down enough is enough so be you on here because a lot of y'all change and stuff to get sponsors girl girl i'm in my, my robe with my hair everywhere and i'll get the sponsors so since i'm sitting right here i'm gonna put them up i have ran out of room <laughs> in these cases right here if you guys can see i have four of them i get them from amazon i will link them below i have literally exhausted all remedies with these cases so all overflow is placed here now <laughs> um i'm gonna do a purge and reorganize if you guys didn't know i have been purging makeup purging perfumes everything because i just have a lot of stuff guys and it's getting overwhelming so shades i put the shades I don't know where the shades that go right there. These things came from Amazon too. All right. And this is like my overflow of glasses. Like all these glasses came from Linsmart. And I still have more to show you guys. Right here. Next video. All right, ladies and gents. Are we crooked? Here we are. I'm just going to keep it pushing. I got a package from the Maui collection. This is Pretty Brie MUA line. Here's the card. It came with my invoice, of course. Pretty packaging. You know, Pretty Bree is gonna, she's all about aesthetics. So you know the packaging was gonna be on point. And I ordered one piece. Of course, I got the piece with purple in it. So these are like um, camis or kimonos. They're tagged, come on Bree. And you can wear them as swimsuit cover-ups, dresses, kimonos whatever you want to wear them as this is the one i got with all of the pretty purple in it brie supports everything i do shapewear whatever so of course i have to support her it's a lot of people out here who see 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 and you can't get them to even buy from you or support your brand so thank you so much brie for all that you do i cannot wait to wear this i'm gonna wear it as a dress i'm gonna be like get them back get them back Y'all know that TikTok? Oh, get him back. Get him back. Hold on. Maybe we like, let me get a purse. Oop. I'm going to be like, oop. Oop. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's for pretty free. I purchased with my own coins, by the way. Child, sis did get a box from Derma E. If you will see later on in the vlog, because everything else is already recorded. This is like an add in that Derma E sent me another package. I already showed it though. So this say, 
proven clean beauty and let's see what all is in here it is it say hey beauty fall into radiant and glowing skin this season so derma e is a very inexpensive skincare brand you can catch them at ulta and their website so i will leave it below they sent over the acne oil control matte moisturizer yeah i remember when i was so oily i'm not oily anymore See what it's trying to focus on. My background kind of busy today. So that's that right there. Here are some reusable cotton rounds. Right, right, right. Right here we got some ultra hydrating dewy skin serum. They be hooking me up. Men should be turning the skincare up. This is the ultra hydrating lip plumping treatment. Ooh, I don't think I've ever tried this from them. This right here is a Shella Good Drama Mascara. I love mascara. Boy, I, I mean, I love it. And this right here is from Shella also, Times Vila Beauty, and it's a Blushing Rose Eyeshadow Palette. And they also be putting little additives like little head wraps in here, and this one just say Derma E. All right. And let's just look at this eyeshadow palette real quick. Y'all know I don't wear eyeshadow no more <laughs> at all. Maybe I should start back. I need to get back to me, honey. Cause I don't, I don't be knowing who this is some days. Oh gosh, this is gorgeous. Really gorgeous. Look at that. There's light out of it. That's my leg shaking, y'all. Y'all heard it? That's a nerve thing. That is absolutely gorgeous. That's like my perfect palette. Like the perfect palette. Like this will be like the perfect travel palette. Thank you, Derma E. And so I did get a package from House of Siage. Y'all know Sweet Dreams. I wanted that mug. Let so I really want to do a TikTok with this. But I know how to unbox it and then still do a TikTok, so. Act like you know, honey. Act like you know. Act like you know. Okay, so I did get. Dang, they wrapping different now. Oh, y'all done skipped on the wrapping? We used to do gift boxes and everything. It's still some right here. So I'll insert a picture because I don't want to open it because I'm about to do an unboxing. Hey, Plat Brats, let's start this week off with a COVID bucket because after having an awesome week last week, now my daughter has COVID. You know, do I need a cleanse or what? Because it's literally something every week with me, okay? So let's just, this right here is just ice in here. This right here is a liquid IV I made her. We're gonna do liquid IV instead of Pedialyte and Gatorade because I like it. Put her some apple juice in here. Of course, the infamous ginger ale. Go ahead and put some Lysol up in there for when she get up to use the restroom. Zinc. For her throat and some more gummies set this in front of her door oh and let me grab some of these little waddles excuse my appearance but exhausted is an understatement because i always no matter how i feel i gotta be nurse and me and Nicole had an argument this morning because Nicole has been like taking her Tylenol and stuff in there and then just leaving going to work. She ain't eating or nothing. You cannot do that. And you at work. So I'm like, did you get her some oatmeal, some water, make sure she's eating? No, she just said her head was hurting. I gave her Tylenol. And I kind of went in there the other day and she was like discombobulated. Like I woke up to see if she was feeling all right. And it's like she didn't even know where she was at. Yeah. This is the third holiday we finna miss. Nicole had a Valentine's Day. I had a 4th of July. And I should finna have it Labor Day. But we gonna make it through it like we always do.
Oh, thank you, sis. Thank you so much. Just so sweet. Yeah, I gotta get my uh ring light out of here to do TikToks. It's in here still from when I went on vacation last. I'm actually thinking of selling um the two smaller pieces to this because it got so damaged from that one trip to Cancun, but the other two pieces are new. And you remember when um she ain't gave me a new luggage tag, child, that's why I needed it. Y'all see that? The wear and tear from traveling. A company sent this. I can't remember which one. So let me get that. So she and took, I mean, gave me a bag and I took this out and kept it. The rest of it is for a giveaway. This, and I'm gonna put this all in here. Um, this is for my sunglasses when I travel. So we got that on courtesy of she and I should go on the website and see if they got a purple one. That's gonna help me a lot because this black luggage, I'm used to having purple luggage. And Lord Jesus, when we was at the airport, it was so hard finding my luggage because everybody got black. So you guys know, this is everything that stay packed. I never move this stuff out of here. So I'm going to just add the little travel thing. And I'm going to add my sunglass thing over here. And zip it back up. And the whole other side is clothes and shoes when I travel. But this side never moves. Girl, where's my life? This is what I need for my TikToks, honey. All right, so this just came today. After I do my TikTok, I'm gonna come back and tell y'all why this is so special to me that it came today and the meaning of why it's so special to me. BRB. See, I've been needing this one specifically because, oh my freaking gosh, I didn't get it out. The whole purpose of why I got this out is it has a phone holder on it. I could just scream. I have to go through all it over again, but oh gosh, this is the setup. When I tell y'all, it's it's a beast getting that luggage out the closet because um, I got so much stuff. This is what I needed so that I could sit my phone right there. Yeah, I look a whole mess today, so now let me figure out how this was on here. Those chai, uh, just clamp it on like that. I don't, I can't find this direct one on Amazon, but it's one in my Amazon store that's quite similar that I will link. All right. All right, guys, so here's the bag. I absolutely love this bag. Um, clearly, I'm a Kurt Geiger fan. You can get them at Dillard's, Macy's, Nordstrom's, those kind of stores. Um... I'm gonna just tell a quick story. Hold on. I'm gonna just tell a quick story. So, May, you guys know it's really, really rough for me. It's the day my mom died, my mom's birthday, my daughter's birthday, my son's birthday, Mother's Day. So, it just hits me kind of hard. So, this was gifted to me from Nordstrom's. Um, but three weeks later, I never got it, it was lost in the mail. Um, and so one of you guys, thank you so much. One of you guys worked at the post office that was holding it and wrote me on Instagram and was like, they were about to send it off to auction and they saw my name on it and, um, saw that it was purple and got it to me the next day. And the next day is the day is nine one, the day my son passed away. So it's just like, it was meant for me to have this bag because <laughs> someone was trying to get it for me to cheer me up in May. And it came on a day that I really, really, really need to be cheered up. So, yeah. You guys know I love this brand. I work for this brand. Actually, I introduced the brand to you guys and then they contacted me. So, here's a bag from them. I just wore this at my cousin's bridal shower. Um, I don't know if any of these bags you can get right now because he sells out so fast. 
so fast. So I just go in Dillard's and try to see. I know I got more than that one. Oh, yeah. I got two over here. Here's a little bling one. Here's another like shade of blue. I mean, dang, purple. And I have a whole lot of other ones, but they're not purple. So they're not in here. But yeah. Love the brand. Stand behind them 100%. I love their marketing is to African Americans, is to the disabled, like their models and stuff on their website. And yeah, I just love them. They're based out of the UK. All right, guys. So what I decided to do is just sit it up there. Um, it was another Chanel bag up there. All I did was um put that one over there. Kind of looks weird sitting on that box like that so let me move that chanel box see that looks a lot better so yeah also real quick the caterer at my class came out with a book it's just a plain notebook but look at the front of it it's so gorgeous so i just supported her because i love to like journal and etc now so i support i can't even remember what, how much it was honestly i just bought it I will link it. It's from Amazon and another one of my classmates. Hold on. And my childhood friend came out with this book called Girl Fuck Him. <laughs> and I will link it below too. Support, support, support. We got to support our own guys. We got to. You know, I was disgusted with how our people was reacting to the pink sauce girl and how another race had to step in and help her. Yeah, we got to help our own people. Brief intermission between clients. I broke my nails cleaning up. I broke one. And I showed you these in my last vlog. I showed these in my last vlog. The only disadvantage is they fit like perfect, which is good because there aren't any extras. Usually with press on nails, they put extra in there. So let me make sure I'm covered. So I got this from Victoria's Secret, the owner of Skin Potion. Oh gosh, which I love Kama Sutra. Oh my gosh, that stuff be making me feel so soft. I will hear Peyton talk about it and how it make you taste good and stuff. And oh my gosh, I will link it below if it's not sold out because it's always sold out. Um, He told me that this from Victoria's Secret will pair well with Kylie Love burning love the cherry scent i think that's what we were talking about we talk about a lot y'all and he went on victoria's secret website and it was on sale you guys know i hardly ever shop victoria's secret um so i will link it below in case they still have it it's a lotion basically i think i probably pay more for shipping than I actually pay for the lotion. Oh, it's so thick. It's called Cherry Elixir, number 33. And let me see if I have a receipt in here. You know how they don't even be putting the price and stuff on this stuff anymore. It was $5.99 and shipping was $8, no cap. So if you can buy more and add this, 
that's better or if you don't mind paying that shipping like I did because I'm not going to go in store right now anyway. So let's get this a good old, let's open it. Victoria's Secret packaging just be so luxurious. Oh, I can already smell that. Mm, that oh my gosh. Yeah, that's perfect for layering with a cherry scent. Cherry Garden House of Siage. Kylie Love, Burning Love Fest, whatever it's called, y'all. Um, Tom Ford Lost Cherry. My Jergen scent, Cherry Almond. Mmm. That smells really good. Thank you so much, Ray. Alright, guys. I'm going to step out really briefly. I will link this week below. I absolutely love it. Low maintenance. I mean, you got to keep it wet, but it's low maintenance. Um, My sister's bridal dress try on is today. Nicole is off. My dad is here. Sugar's feeling way better. So, I'm going to dip out to um her bridal fitting. I asked her did she feel comfortable with me coming because I, uh, I have been quarantined and she's one of them people that's fascinated and feel like they can't be touched. <laughs> if you're watching this, no, I'm just playing. <laughs> no, but for real, she told me to come on. So, I'm good. I tested. When did I test? So, yeah. It's real quick. And it starts in 15 minutes, so let me go. Okay, y'all, we are at my sister's dress fitting. I had to get up and move because the dress is like literally right there. We got 99 problems, and the biggest one is me. Got all these little, and the biggest one is me. Hey, okay. So, I see it. I see it. It's talking. Put some horse hair in it. Yeah, we gotta put horse hair That's in it. That's all y'all can see. Really quick, cause sis need to eat her soup. That it was like a really good high tech drill and I felt like I should give it to my nail tech because she would put more use to it. But I have been wearing my press-ons lately cause between us, y'all, I ain't gonna even lie, I haven't been to a nail shop, nail shop in a long time. And when I went right before Cancun, I got COVID. So now I'm kind of like paranoid again. I have been going to my little boo who, uh, she stays in my neighborhood, but she's in college. So for the wedding, she was in El Salvador. So I had no choice but to go to the nail shop and I got COVID. Not saying it came from the nail shop, but I don't know where it came from. So anyway, I said I'll bet to say that I got another drill. It was only like 12 bucks, guys. And I got this so that I can repurpose my press-ons. Um, you know, when you take them off, they have all that like glue and stuff in the inside. So I just got like a little drill. It came with a lot to only be like $12. And you guys know I had to get purple. Excuse this nail, I broke it. I'm gonna replace it in a minute. Came with a lot of stuff. It even came with the drill bits, whatever them things call. Okay, so I'm not trying to do nails or nothing with it. Oh, my soup is ready. I'm just trying to like, so when I take these off, I can drill that glue out the inside and reuse them again. Oh, I look like somebody auntie. I need to put some makeup on because I'm trying to like a hot girl, a lit auntie, not the uh, drunk auntie at the barbecue. So it's my cousin's birthday, the one who always share her fragrances with me, vice versa. And so I'm going to surprise her. I'm going to go to Ulta and Sephora and smell the new Prada, the new Lieb. Okay, and the new Burberry. Let's go.
you want to call me out? <laughs> Look, y'all. What's your name? Tria. <laughs> what you get? was ironic okay I came here to get my cousin a gift and the lady was like you using your own money she was like apply for a dealer's card yeah I ain't gonna lie I got like 13 credit cards <laughs> so I was like mm. I went ahead and applied why do they act so shocked when we get approved no, no shade to her because she was beautiful Latara come check her out anytime dealer Cedar Hill but everywhere I go even like when I go for like dental services and stuff they're like <gasps> And there's so much on there. Y'all worked hard to get there because up until like five years ago, my shit was garbage. Couldn't get nothing in my name. So I'm proud of it. So I didn't have to pay for this today. I mean, I, I'm going to have to pay for it eventually, but you know. I still can't see me. She not even answering. I don't want to just leave this on her porch. She here though. Y'all go calling people on y'all auntie. See y'all, I'm glad I got my lazy tail out. She was in there, put her grandbaby to sleep. And here come my loud ass, happy birthday! And she just put the baby to sleep. <sighs> so how about we sit here and talk about everything that I got? Um, because it's so pretty, I love my flowers. Thank everybody who sent me flowers this week because of the obvious. But, okay, here's the new Burberry Elixir Her. This is the bomb to me. This is the bottle. I did not get the big bottle. I'm over those big bottles because with all the perfume I got, who needs big bottles, right? So, um, this is very, let me see, how can I explain it and compare it? It's very much sweet. If you're not a sweet girl, don't even do it, honey. Don't do it. Don't do it to yourself. Don't, don't, don't. I love it, though. I love it. And so, then I end up getting the new Prada Paradox. Like, y'all, this bottle alone is what I probably should have got the big one of. Because I just love that bottle. Oh, my gosh. Now, this scent profile is a little different. Um, if you are more into, hold on, it's ironic because it's almost like the complete opposite of that Burberry Elixir. Let's give you guys a little bit more light. It's like more, I would say this is nighttime and grown and sexy. Like this is me and I feel like me and Shug could get away with this. Does that make sense? All right guys, so I've started this purge out of this case. This is just stuff that I'm not gonna wear, not gonna reach for, or just don't wanna keep. Emptied it out pretty, pretty empty. Pretty, pretty empty. So, this is everything I decided to get rid of. A bunch of dossiers that I got the real one of that I'll never reach for because I got the real one. So, yeah. Now we can move over here. I can tell you for a fact these two nothing much is moving because these are very expensive perfumes so i absolutely don't buy them unless i love them so yeah <laughs> no all right guys this is the rest that's going to go um like i said these two tops wasn't touched much um so i'm going to rearrange everything now since i've decluttered all right guys 50 bottles decluttered <laughs> still look like a lot i moved some things around Someone just asked me how many bottles I had, and I ain't even counted, y'all. But 50 bottles are gone. Good morning. Labor Day is over. Now I have to go slay by my lonesome. Yeah, this smells so dang on good. This Burberry looks so. Why does light look like this? I need to reset my camera. Mmm. It's putting Burberry her to shame. Nah, they two totally different types. This is creamy and sweet. Burberry hair is Julia Baccarat. Y'all know that. 
Yeah, look at this bank. They think it's pink. <laughs> Let me tell you how it pays to be nice to people. Sorry, I'm looking like y'all lit honey. Not lit auntie. Them bitches almost ran in the back of me. Y'all heard that? I'm looking like y'all barbecue auntie today. So I'm in Sonic. Y'all know how I gotta get my potato tots with cheese, which I need to stop, but it's a quick power me up. And um the girl came in, my meal was like four dollars and some. And so I gave her a 10. And she was like, okay, I'll be right back with your change. And I was like, no, just keep the change. She was like, all of it? You want me to keep all of it? And I was like, yeah, it's hot out here. You deserve it. Even though it's only like $5 and some change. So she was like, you know what? I'll be right back. She said, I'm finna go make your tots fresh. And these motherfuckers is good. Do you hear me? They just crispy, crunchy. Mmm. Boy, thank you, baby. Made it to work. I know y'all want to work with me. I know it, I know it, I know it. But I got so much to do today. I don't have time to play on the camera, y'all. Love y'all to pieces, but not today. Y'all, I still haven't packed them larges up. Y'all, I still haven't packed those larges, I mean, them smiles up from the bundles. I actually still haven't took them off the website, so they're still selling. Guess I'll just leave them on there. What is it gonna hurt? Should be weird to me, y'all. Come on, bro. Alright. So, since I get to work, I'm gonna find me a good YouTube video to watch. Who can I watch, y'all? Well, who loaded? <laughs> That's the question. Let's see who we gonna watch while I'm at work. Holly Miller, sign up for Sticker Mule. I'll put them below. When they go on sale, check out multiple times under different names, y'all. Don't tell you. Don't tell. Don't say platinum. Didn't tell y'all. Nobody posted. All right, let me. Now I don't want to watch Sheree right now because I'm trying not to buy no perfume. So that's conflict of interest. Okay, that's my girl though. Oh, let me watch the uh, van girl. Have you ever wanted to live the van life of Forge 4 before is giving you that chance? She literally got two million subscribers overnight living at her van. Like, social media is something else. You never know what's going to hit. First, let me pack my kit up because I'm milling that perfume from home. So let me take everything I need home. They're so from Sticker Mill too. They're just poly mailers. Just trying to be aesthetic. Okay. I'm gonna send Rochelle some stuff and I need bigger boxes. I wish I could just take the stuff to Houston. But I don't know when the next time I'm going to Houston. And what a lot of y'all don't know is Houston ain't close. Whenever somebody needs something done in Houston, y'all be tagging me. And I'm like, girl, I'm five, four hours away. We ain't close. I know y'all think of it as like New York, Brooklyn Island. It's just crossing through a lot. It's not like that in Texas, baby. Texas, huge. Like, Huge. <laughs> All right. Let me stop playing and get on it. These shipping bags come from Amazon. I got a lot of them. I even got them in blue. Ooh, where they at? Right there. I'm trying to see if I got some crinkle paper stuff. I don't think I do. I used it all. Ooh, your girl been working. I don't have none of it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me take these. I individually wrap. This is everything for the perfume. Boom. Boom. Thank you, stickers. And make up our platinum cards. Oh, where they at, y'all? Oh, and tape. This is my all time favorite tape in the universe. I get it by the book from Amazon. It glides so smooth. I love it. Only need one of them. All right guys, so that quick, I just made me a mini shipping station. This is flat rate envelopes, my contour me bubbles. 
this is um regular priority boxes you can order all this free at the post office i'll link it below this is this type of flat rate envelopes this is a medium flat rate boxes this is a small priority boxes more flat rate envelopes this is the shoe box size priority boxes this is the medium flat rate these are two different medium flat rate this is the long one and this is the regular size box and those are shipping envelope child i had to bring some stuff on home to finish it off this is about to turn to a shipping station <laughs> i did get a package from shein i got a box from derma e i will link everything in here below this is the derma e vitamin c serum radiant radiant glow is the way to go is what it say so there are three items in here this is the skin brightener uh oh we don't want to focus today skin brighten vitamin c doctor developed <laughs> this is the vitamin c concentrate serum my baby girl loves that y'all know that and this right here is the vitamin c intense night cream thank you so much Dermot e almost a week later and my flowers are doing very well i just put a little bleach and sugar and ice in the water this one is kind of like it's some stuff i need to take up out of here this one was so gorgeous at first it's starting to this one stinks though i was sitting here and i was like girl i know that ain't me bro it was the plants <laughs> so guys i do got a sponsorship with Shein, and then i got a lot of new stuff um from a gift card they gave me from promoting the pop-up in texas i don't know if this is that stuff or the sponsorship stuff i have no idea um dang it's a lot is this even my order this is the it is so much stuff okay let me just open it all righty ladies and gents it was the sponsorship package Oh, it's some good stuff in here. Don't look too hard. It's a jelly shoe. Y'all know that it's been sitting over there. I need to do real quick. <sighs> I'm trying to work because Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I want to zone out a little bit and go out of town or something. <laughs> It's roughly 8 33 and i have been working since 11. all those perfume orders all of the perfume orders have been boxed got some p.o box packages let's see what's in here yeah i don't even pay me no attention at any light is the week even on it's been a rough couple of days It's a perfume. Thank you for everybody who participated in the perfume sale. I should do that once a month. Forty-seven dollars gone, and my cabinet still look full. I'm like, bruh. China. This is like my dream perfume. You know how you have a dream bag, dream car, with the ticket on it. I ain't no cheaper than Baccarat. Look at this case. The top is off. La Capitale. my dream i love this fragrance i had a sample i just kept saying that ticket <laughs> pretty steep <laughs> it smells so 
so good, y'all. I'll link it below. I had a um I had a Macari mixed up with something I got like for a, a gift. And got to me it wasn't real. It was the Baccarat straight. But I it's just like Poshmark. Once you accept it, there's nothing that can be done. Like if you're on Poshmark, if somebody send you a fake purse before you accept it and Poshmark pay them out, you report it. So they won't get paid. Well, in the case with the Baccarat, I don't know why. I just didn't know that people were selling fake perfume like that. So I just accepted it as soon as it was delivered so the person could get paid. And it ended up being fake. And it's nothing Makari could do because I accepted it. So they did disable the user account. But all they have to do is start another one, right? And I was just out of $200. And everybody kept asking me how did I know it was fake. Because I compared it to the real one. The nozzle was different. The sticker on the bottom was different. The lasting power wasn't there. So this is from. So be careful on Makari. Or just trust. I have some trusted vendors that I go through all the time. I just keep going, huh? Keep going through them so I don't get got. Honestly, I have like five more dream fragrances and there's nothing else I really should be getting unless some new come out. So this is from A. Marie Beauty, y'all remember? And I was doing that Get Ready With Me and I was saying how um she's so sweet. So I'm having a giveaway if it's still going and you have to subscribe to her channel. That's one of the rules to the giveaway. Well, anyway, I was saying I love this pencil so much. It is called Raisin. That's like hit it, guys. Um, you are the heart of my business. Your purchase made by my day. I hope this package boosts your confidence. That's what's in there. And she sent me one, two, three, four, five, six of them. I love this pencil, guys. <laughs> it's Raisin. I will check and see if it's still on her website. It was the tutorial where I was, it wasn't a tutorial, it was, I was getting ready in a vlog. And I, what was I talking about? Um, business. Business. And I was like, this is, it reminds me of Mac Night Mop, I want to say. Thank you so much. I use them so fast, y'all. Because I don't know why lip liners go so fast for me. And so she sent me another box. This is from her too. She had already sent this one out. So while I open this one, um, I had said that I would take questions about plus size women getting men in the industry and only two of y'all asked the question. So I might as well answer those. One of them say, is it good to go out alone or in a group? Um, that's a hard question to answer because that would depend on who your group is. Like, everybody you can't do dirt with. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Um, some people be jealous. Some people be cock blocking. Lord Jesus. They be hating. So, um, but it's always safer to go out in a group. Now, if you're talking about in terms of full size chicks getting high dollar men, um, how that work is a lot of times they be not embarrassed to approach you and so they send somebody else for your number or something does that make sense nowadays they probably don't when i was going that route that was 20 25 years ago yeah i gotta remember i'm about to be 42. so something broke in here nowadays they probably just shoot they shot us Big girls are in here. So this is the box right here. The box is so cute. I am a person who I, I you know I do constructive criticism when y'all send stuff to my PO box. I don't believe in putting your picture all over your box, your logos, your boxes and stuff. Because what they do is like when people don't like you, they won't shop. I, it like it's weird so remain anonymous um or some people consider that ghetto oh nothing's wasting it's just some kind of paper she had in here but like um it's kind of like when we all started our youtube we was like badass platinum and blah 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 and all of us have changed our name well except me i want to change the nikki Dorn, but i don't want to mess up my numbers 
So, God dang, I've been talking seven minutes. So there's a note in here. Y'all call this plant brat, 20% off. Let me read my note. She's just thanking me because she, when she closed AMB Lavish, it was the end of her dreams, but with prayers and tears and my kind words, it pushed her to keep go back to the drawing board. So she sent me some of her rebranding stuff. All right. You do not have to share this box with the plant breasts. You do not have to share this box with the plant breasts, but I did include a code. Okay. So that's all on the inside up here. But like, back to I was saying about the logo, yeah, like, keep your face off of it, because when you want to appeal to a bigger market, there are, like, other races and stuff that won't support you just because you are black. So if your logo is on there and you're black, you know, if they don't know what race you are and they like your products, they just go support. That's just like that one couple who got their house appraised or something, and when they took they was black off the application and went up 300,000, people really do discriminate because of stuff like that. So that's just a little constructive criticism. So this next question is, when I'm ready, will you take me where you and P were pulling the whites with the money? <laughs> Anytime, anytime, yeah. <laughs> anytime that's somebody I know personally. Anytime you ready. Let's go. <laughs> all right, so let's get into this box. That's all of the questions. The questions I do ask on Instagram. So look at my stories. This is a pumpkin crisp beauty bar. It's a soap. This is blue purple waist beads. Here are some blue and purple waist beads. Here's a bracelet. It has like a credit card on it. Let me focus. A dice, m &Ms. Lashes, oh, those are so cute and fluffy. And here's some lashes. This is a sample size of a lotion. It's called Lady of the Day Sample Size Lotion. Mm, that smells really good. Okay, here's brow styling soap. Here's, is this a facial mist? Brow mist, hydra, and I guess a um, brow liquid. I check into it and put it across the screen. It's a lot of stuff in this box, guys. Here's a keychain. It's purple. Y'all know I wear these as bag charms lashes on this bag. Oh, stuff. Okay, sis. There's scissors in here. I need these so bad. Y'all know I just bought some scissors off Amazon. A red liquid lipstick and blushing. This is, it looks like a liner. Uh oh Yep, a liquid liner. It's cute. Look at that packaging. Here is Juicy lip gloss. It's a lip gloss. It's clear. And this is black eyelash glue. I love that was in that bag. There's a palette. What's in here? I know it's lashes. I knew it as soon as I felt the density of it. That's too cute. Here's a um, Sweet Lady, the Everyday Lady Body Oil. She do her own packaging and all that, guys. And there's two more things in here. What's that? Uh, I brought pencils. Both in the number five. Let's see what the number five. Oh, yeah, I just hit my knee. First off, pulling up. So I brought pencils in here. This kind would like the thicker. So, thank you so much, boo. Congrats on rebranding. I wish you all success. Sorry I'm not all over you, but I already told y'all it's been a day, a night. What we have right here, my dear, is the $3 Chipotle hack. So let me go back because I don't even remember what I put on mine. So they wanted bowls. I wanted a burrito. So hopefully this is the tortilla. Three dollars, y'all. Don't say I didn't tell you. So you get a taco. I don't know what they're doing. 
Okay, let me pick what's what. Chipotle told me to stop feeling these tacos so much, probably. This one has chicken, cheese, rice, and lettuce. Did you get lettuce, Nicole? You do, because you got all of this from the taco and the burrito. They both had corn. Then I just add beans. So I'm missing. I'm a little sour cream now. And there's my three dollar burrito. You know they usually like eight, nine, ten, eleven if you order them on Uber and stuff. So what you do is order one taco, get all your items as a side: the beans, the sour cream, the cheese. It's no upcharge. Then you order a tortilla. You take everything off the taco and make your burrito. Three dollars. All right, y'all. We headed out today. I have to go to UPS and FedEx because I did sell the extra bottle of uh, Exalte because I'm like with so many perfume, probably 300 bottles, I never run out of Exalte. And if I do buy that time, it might be bad. The person tried to finesse me, but girl, no, I paid 250 for that and it sold out. I'm not going any cheaper. And I sold Whisper Anur. I hate that scent so much. It was four hundred and ninety-five dollars, and I let it go for one hundred and fifty, just to get it out of my collection. I look like a mad woman. I kind of like this hair big like this, but it's cute. With two people in there said I smell good. Like I had to pull my phone out and everything and show them my um, reel to show them what I had on. So the Exalte shipped off. Now let's ship off the house to see Audrey. She was lucky. Well, both of them was. Both of them, the Exalte is still in the plastic. She got the whole House of CR's box with all the extra stuff they sent in it too. I just put it back in that box. The, the box, the, it came in, the box they sent it in and put it in this envelope. So now I gotta go to UPS. Okay, both of those are shipped. Let's go next door and get lunch. So I'ma just take y'all with me. I love them. Now, that's a lot of the different locations. I can't tell y'all about every other location because y'all be want to fight. Tussle. I ain't trying to tussle. Hey, how you doing? Hey, how are you? I got seven minutes, so I'm going to walk my ass on over here to Starbucks. Please don't get hit. Oh, trying to go get some coffee. Y'all know I have to check out the cups. All right, y'all. Here my meal. Cedar Hill only. We don't care about all them other locations, all right? So, y'all know I eat this every day. For my wings and my, what are they? He checked me. <laughs> well, sweep off the caboose, y'all. I got free. Oh, I forgot to get napkins. And my Starbucks is leaking. Um, I got compliments in Starbucks and I got compliments in Wing World. Actually, in both places, <laughs> they took my number down for other stuff. I'm pissed off doing all that talking. I forgot my wrench. I got sweet and sour. Let me try that with you. Think it's, let me try that with this too. Boy, ain't nobody record you. He putting on the whole show. I'm not recording. <laughs> I'm not recording you, bro. Yeah. Mmm, that's kind of tasty. I'm sitting in front of Bass and Byron. Oh, sorry, y'all. Damn. And this one, I don't have no rewards. I know I had two rewards on here. And they didn't expire to November. I know I did, bro. I know I did. I'm finna get ticked off. I knew this was gonna happen. Soon as I get home. And I'm going back, because I don't want to be in this house. Let's go. Another Shein pack. So I'm right across from H&M, right? So what I can do after Bath and Body Works go to H&M, I've been wanting to go in there because I need like some plain body suits and stuff. I see Pretty Bree and Chelsea in here all the time, right? Um, so I'm gonna get them a try. 
the, the girls love H&M and um, motherfucking Zyra, but anything I want from Zyra, I'm getting from Shein for a fraction of the price, all right? Got another dupe for you guys. Fall in the bloom, smells like Burberry hair. All right, guys, had to sit in the car before I went to H&M. Ate them uh, boneless wings too fast, honey. They got gastric problems. Eat slow. So slow your food be getting cold. And chew 32 times. You don't need none solid going down. Chew, chew, chew. You don't know how to chew. So, for free, I had two rewards to get some free. I got the End of Stars, which is a dupe for Baccarat. And I got the um, Fall in Bloom, which is a dupe for Burberry Hair. Which is ironic, because they say Burberry Hair is a dupe for Baccarat. So, do these smell alike? <laughs> so, I got both of them free. They had a new peach hand soap in her. It smells awesome. But she told me not to get it and pay full price because it's a coupon coming in the mail so wait on the coupon and so i just got both of these because they were free so sign up for the bath and body work app and the rewards and they send you free coupons see now i'm sitting this car and i'm hesitating because i really don't need to be spending no money i really don't i really don't so should i go in here or not y'all I ain't like y'all can answer me, but. Mm -mm. Ooh, let's go. I got on out, y'all. I'ma just look around. They got a sale. Just don't want to go home, basically. Yeah, I thought I was recording the whole time it wasn't. Or my camera died. I got it in black. I gotta go back in here. This rung up $9.99 and it's $3. No, ma'am. I was gonna let them slide, but no, ma'am. I got it in a large. I got the same exact dress in a green. They were $3, like I say, in case the camera didn't pick that up on the last clip. This one was $5. Go tie around your neck. And it just flares out. It's really great material. It's a dress. I got that in a large and uh, extra large. This one was $5 too. I would consider this more like something you wear over your swimsuit or something because it's sheer. But it's a cute mint green. And I got it um, for $5 as well. Or you could put like something under it and wear it as a dress. But baby, it's sheer. So be careful. I just love that color. And the last thing I got was a bodysuit. I'm checking all this because this oh it was right this bodysuit was 10.99 bro take i needed a black bodysuit boy this thing little why well, get it in a medium because i wanted to feel like shaper but yeah that's it everything was 26 dollars, and i got 10 percent off because i signed up for the app so 26 dollars, y'all and it's one two three four five outfits five dresses Okay, H&M. Back to this. It's more she and stuff. Gotta get to work. I don't know how I end up in here, but I'm looking for something for somebody that, of course, I'm not gonna find today because I'm looking for it. Y'all know I searched for this 30 years and couldn't find it. And one of you guys gave it to me and they done went up. It used to be $19.99, bro. They locked and loaded in here today. They don't have a dark cherry one, though. That's the best one. Ooh, another one. Oh, they took these up. That camera died in Burlington, but I did end up getting this one. Why? I might put it in a giveaway for some of y'all. And I got my, this is my favorite. This one right here is my favorite. But we're going to try this one too.